Hey yo, what's up guys and welcome back to ETV Reacts. How are we all doing, Eternals? So, um, just on the uh, reaction to M&M's new track, Toby. <laughs> um, that was requested by my um, roommate, my best friend, my cousin, brother from another mother. Um, because it was brand new. I was like, okay. He asked me to do it yesterday, but I wasn't feeling well. <clears throat> um... Yeah, that's why I haven't uh, uploaded anything for the last two days, because I've been feeling like, ugh. Um, feeling better now. <clears throat> so, um, back to the list. <laughs> and uh, next on the list, we have Mr. Tom McDonald, Mad Child, and Nova. Now, not heard of Mad Child before. Um, Clara Nielsen told me that he was... I think was in a group then by himself correct me if I'm wrong Clara um, but yeah he, he's he's pretty big apparently um, just I've never crossed it, his path um, I absolutely love Tom and Nova as you already know so this, this is going to be interesting and uh, just by judging by the title and the way this opening shot shot is um yeah it, i i feel i know which way this is going and as we know i've dealt with addiction back uh, in my past as well so this is probably going to hit home for me too so um shout out to carolyn and clara nielsen who requested this um i think a couple of other people did request it, so shout out to the whole of Hangover Gang. Shout out to the Eternals. Um, I love you all. Respect and appreciate all the comments and everything like that. Um, if you're new to the channel and you want to join the Eternals family, hit subscribe, like, notification bell, comment. Let me know what you want me to react to. And as I always say, it doesn't have to be just music. It can be anything. So, let's have a little look, see what we've got today. What up, y'all? My name's Tom. Little while back was an alcoholic. Had a mental breakdown like a year ago. Came close to putting me in a coffin. Damn. After the hooker I loved. After I did... Sorry. Did you seem that was sink then? I, I, I shouldn't be surprised anymore, but nine times out of ten, he just goes straight in. <laughs> I think he's one of the only artists I know Well, there's probably a couple of artists who do it But usually you get like a 20 second intro And then you you start But Tom, he's like straight <laughs> What up y'all, my name's Tom Little while back was an alcoholic Had a mental breakdown like a year ago Came close to putting me in a coffin Damn after the hooker I loved, after I did all the drugs After I finally got fired for showing up late to the job, hella tired and drunk After the oxys I put up my nose with my boss on the oil rigs when I was young After my ex cut her wrists and the cops that I stabbed her and beat me and put me in cuffs After I totaled my car trying to run from the cops with a- Wait, what? Was that true? Sorry what up y'all, my name's Tom, little while back was an alcoholic Had a mental breakdown like a year ago, came close to putting me in a coffin Damn, after the hooker I loved, after I did all the drugs After I finally got fired for showing up late to the job, hella tired and drunk After the oxys I put up my nose with my boss on the oil rigs when I was young After my ex cut her wrists and the cops that I stabbed her and beat me then put me in cuffs After I totaled my car trying to run from the cops with a kilo of coke in the trunk After I drank till I rotted my teeth on my head, got infections and all of my gums After I couldn't get hard cause the vodka and porno sedated me till I was numb After I couldn't escape from the basement I rented and went to go live with my mom After I cheated on people I needed and lied trying to hide from the guy that I sorry this is hitting me because it's like you can see it in his face even when he's just sat there like and you can see the genuine in his face and when he's like on the in the other shot and you can see the tears in his eyes even though the, no over the magic on the camera you can still see the tears in his eyes it's just real like you can see it there and everything he's saying is, yeah. 
and the cops that I stabbed her and beat me and put me in cuffs. If anyone knows what he's talking about there, please fill me in. Because that sounds insane. And, um... I mean, when I was dealing with my addiction, I was really rock bottom. So some of what he's saying, I, I get. Obviously, he had a different addiction to what I did. So mine was ecstasy, his, his was alcohol. And um, obviously, he was doing other stuff. Was he sniffing Xanax? Was it Xanax, he said? Or Oxy? Tired for showing up late to the job, hella tired and drunk. After the oxys, I put up my nose with my boss on the oil rigs when I was young. After my ex cut her wrists and the cops that I stabbed her and beat me and put me in cuffs. After I totaled my car trying to run from the cops with a kilo of coke in the trunk. After I drank till I rotted my teeth on my head, got infections in all of my gums. After I couldn't get hard cause the vodka and porno sedated me till I was numb. After I couldn't escape from the basement I rented and went to go live with my mom. After I cheated on people I needed and lied trying to hide from the guy that I was. Then I got sober, the madness was over now i am proud of the man i become yeah. hey nova um yeah i mean what you said like the addiction makes you a totally different person um it takes you out of your um It's like a trans. I don't know how to explain it. It's like it brings out your the side of you that everyone keeps buried deep inside. Because obviously, if you're high or you're drunk or whatever the case may be, you have no inner strength to keep that shit bottled down and um, kept in the basement, so to speak. I mean, for me. I get that tremendously because I feel like I've got a dark side to myself, which is why my name is ETV, Eternal Vice. So Eternal is my good side, Vice is my inner demon, shall we say. So it's like, to keep that inner demon from coming out, you have to have clarity in your mind, you have to have ambitions. You, you, you can't, as soon as you do something to lower your ambitions, it, it, that's when your inner demon will just creep out and see that opening and just... And that's when you become a totally different person, out of character. And some people are stuck in that addiction for so long that they cannot get back out of it. And they become the inner demon rather than their true self. If that makes sense. After I couldn't escape from the basement I rented and went to go live with my mom. After I cheated on people I needed and lied trying to hide from the guy that I was. Then I got sober. The madness was over. So far this beat is so simple. The click and the... Trying to run from the cops with a kilo of coke in the trunk. After I drank till I rotted my teeth on my head got infections and... And obviously you got the... My gums. After I couldn't get hard cause the vodka and porno sedated me till I was numb After I couldn't escape from the basement I rented and went to go live with my mom After I cheated on people I needed and lied trying to hide from the guy that I was Then I got sober, the madness was over, now I am proud of the man I become yeah. I'm finding someone that I know again I started climbing out the hole I'm in Fighting demons and I'm no Exactly what I was saying just now, fighting demons and... <sighs> Infections and all of my gums. After I couldn't get hard cause the vodka and porno sedated me till I was numb. After I couldn't escape from the basement I rented and went to go live with my mom. After I cheated on people I needed and lied trying to hide from the guy that I was. Then I got sober, the madness was over. Now I am proud of the man I become. Yeah. I'm finally someone that I know again. I started climbing out the hole I'm in. Fighting demons and I'm no Wow. 
that went epic in like 0 0.2 seconds. <laughs> what the fuck? I love it when Tom and Nova are like in sync together as well. That, that is so fire. I love it when they're both like doing the same actions like yeah. <laughs> I think I said on the last was it I wish I like Tom's moves like the, the way he does his unique moves and you see Tom and Nova doing exactly the same thing totally in sync it, that's mm. Nova's got that type of, oh my god, I got chills. Um, it's like that, like Nova can put off like a choir sound just by herself. <laughs> I know she layers her vocals to do it, but it's just the way she does it though. It... <sighs> Best female artist on the planet. For a while now, I was waking up feeling suicidal, but I think I'm finally starting to smile now. Man, I lived a hell of a life. I've been to hell and back twice. Lost ten million dollars through different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price from penthouses with top. Hold up. <sighs> Chills as soon as he started rapping. Um, he's got that. He's got a very unique voice. I think I have heard that voice before. It's very unique and very distinctive. Shit, man. Waking up, feeling suicidal, but I think I'm finally starting to smile now. Man, I lived a hell of a life. Sorry, you need to go back to the beginning of his verse. Yo, my name's Mad Child. I've been off to Zanny's for a while now. I was waking up feeling suicidal, but I think I'm finally starting to smile now. Man, I lived a hell of a life. I've been to hell and back twice. Lost $10 million through different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price from penthouses with. Lost $10 million to three different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price. <sighs> Just imagine that for a second. Three separate addictions, you lose $10 million. That alone, if you're not strong-willed, that alone will... <sighs> and for him to come away from that... Shit, man. Yo, props to my child. I got total respect for him already, like. Waking up, feeling suicidal, but I think I'm finally starting to smile now. Man, I lived a hell of a life. I've been to hell and back twice. Lost $10 million through different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price from penthouses with top mob. So he's been to hell and back twice. 
so he's obviously been addicted, recovered, relapsed, and had to go through it all again. I've said it on another video um, about just relapsing that one time can destroy everything that you've worked for to get clean again um and it and it just resets the clock and you have to go for, right back to the beginning it's like i always say life is like a ladder and at the top of this ladder you've got happiness success whatever the case may be whatever you're trying to go for as a life goal your life goal is at the top of that ladder now for your life you're climbing up this ladder and you always get stuff that will knock you down a few steps. Now, to some people like me, Tom, Nova, my child, other people, you out there, the Eternals, um, some people don't get just knocked down a few pegs. They get knocked right down to the bottom where they hit rock bottom. And then you have to find the strength within yourself to pick yourself up, dust yourself off, Wipe your wounds and just start climbing that ladder once again. Now, a lot of people can get knocked off this ladder multiple times and keep climbing and climbing and climbing. Some people never get to the top. But it's how you don't give up and you keep climbing, no matter how many times you get knocked off. And one day... If you keep climbing and you don't give up, you will get to the top. That's what I believe. That's what I pray for. That's what I hope for. Waking up feeling suicidal, but I think I'm finally starting to smile now, man. I lived a hell of a life. I've been to hell and back twice. Lost $10 million through different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price. From penthouses with top models, hanging with strippers with pop bottles. You're anxious and hiding alone in my room from the world. I was pissing in pop bottles. From chart top and being a role model to flop records and lost follows. When I caught Prada, got a month's worth. When I left the spot, cops followed. You saw a photo. What was that? Sorry, I've gone back too far. What up, y'all? My name's Mad Child. I've been off to Zanny's for a while now. I was waking up feeling suicidal, but I think I'm finally starting to smile now. Man, I lived a hell of a life. I've been to hell and back twice. Lost $10 million through different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price. From penthouses with top models. Hanging with strippers with pop bottles. You're anxious and hiding alone in my room from the world. I was pissing in pop bottles. From chart top and being a role model. To flop records and lost follows. When I caught product, I got a month's worth. From chart top into being role models to now, man, I lived a hell of a life. I've been to hell and back twice. Lost ten million dollars through different addictions. Don't tell me about paying the price. From penthouses with top models, hanging with strippers with pop bottles. You're anxious and hiding alone in my room from the world. I was pissing in pop bottles. From chart top and being a role model to flop records and lost follows. When I caught product got a mo to flop records and lost follows. So. Obviously, where Clara said to me before, he was quite big before. Was he in a crew or something or group? Clara, you'll let me know. So he's got to the pinnacle of his career, you know. And then, as I said, knocked off his ladder. And he said he's been there hell and back twice now, so he must have like come off his ladder, started climbing again. And when he got to a point, he got knocked off again and started climbing again. And I think this is his th third attempt. So I'm hope uh, I hope he carries on with his recovery, man. Stick with Tom. Shit. If you've got any requests for Mad Child, I need to know more about him, so drop them in the requests. With strippers with pop bottles, You're anxious and hiding alone in my room from the world. I was pissing in pop bottles from chart top and being a role model to flop records and lost follows. When I caught product, got a month's worth. When I left the spot, 
cops followed. You saw a photo, it was only face, cause I was 85 pounds overweight. Mental breakdown, trying to catch a plane. Wasn't mad, child, I was only Shane. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a grave. I walked away from every brick I laid so I could build a new wall to keep me safe. Whoa, right. Um, first of all, Follows when a cop product got a month's worth. When I left the spot, cops followed. You saw a photo, it was only face, cause I was 85 pounds overweight. Mental breakdown, trying to catch a plane. Wasn't mad, child, I was only Shane. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a grave. So that hit me there. His puppy Lola was his only gang. Oh. When I left the spot, cops followed. You saw a photo, it was only face, cause I was 85 pounds overweight. Mental breakdown, trying to catch a plane. Wasn't mad, child, I was only Shane. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a grave. His puppy Lola was his only gang, and he had to put his baby in the grave. Fuck, man. See, I'm the type of person who, if you've got a pet, like a dog or something, it's not just a pet, it's not just an animal, it's part of the family. So, to lose that connection that you have, especially when you're going through all this shit, and if that was your only thing to wake up for in the morning, then you'd suddenly lose it. Shit. Yo, my child is deep, man. I, I like this guy. And he, like I said, his voice is very distinctive. I'm pretty sure I've heard it before, but I can't think. It's just that distinctiveness in his voice and the grit. I love it. Walked away from every brick I laid so I could build a new wall to keep me safe. Wasn't mad, child, I was only Shane. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a... Grave. I walked away from every brick I laid so I could build a new wall to keep me safe. I walked away from every brick I laid to build a new wall to make me safe. That, again, is something I can resonate with because I always put up a wall. Some people break through that wall, but then they have to rebuild that wall then to keep other people out. So, yeah. Overweight, mental breakdown, trying to catch a plane. Wasn't mad, child, I was only Shane. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a grave. I walked away from every brick I laid so I could build a new wall to keep me safe. I'm finding someone that I know again. I started climbing out the hole I'm in. Fighting demons and I know I win. It's time for me to mend these broken ways. You know, that's true as well with addiction. It's a war that you fight forever. You know, you could be 20 years clean, you could be 30 years clean, but you still are not cured because, like, in September I'll be 40 and I've been clean since, like, say 21. That's where I've been clean from. So, all that time I've been clean. I'm still not cured because every day when I wake up, the first thing I think of is ecstasy and how many pills I want to pop. But then you've got to keep that strong mind and your strong willpower to say, nope, I am not falling back into that. So it is a war that you fight forever. And it's a war that I'm proud to fight because I'm proud of what I've done since being 21 up until now, you know, and how I've grown as a person and not letting him, not letting my past define who I am and mistakes that my parents made, I'm not going to follow that tradition on, I'm going to break that cycle and be different. 
yes, I make mistakes. Yes, I'm not perfect, but I know what not to do, if that makes sense. Oh, shit, this song is deep, man. I'm my child. Much respect. I mean, look at the passion that Matt Charles doing in the hook there. Give me chills, like I, it's hot as shit, but I feel cold because of this. Like you give me the chills, oh, my days. And look at that passion on that face right there. You can't fake that shit. You can see the. I know that visually they've probably sprayed water in the face, but look at his eyes. You can see. His tears in his eyes, so that you can't fake. When you fall down, the world's closing. In. Well, please tell me, Nova gets a verse. I'm saying that even if she doesn't, she her presence is in the hook, as always. She is just, like, elevated that shit to a whole different fucking stratosphere. When you fall down, the world's closing in. You can get up again, up again Life has been hard, I know it gets better This is a war that I'll fight forever Love that picture. <sighs> that was just amazing. I, I know, and I know what bar the track is. Sorry. It's only shame. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a grave. I walked away from every brick I laid so I could build a new wall to keep me safe. I walked away from every brick I laid to build a new wall to... Was it... Wasn't mad, child, I was only Shane. My puppy Lola was my only gang. Had to put my baby in a grave. I walked away from every brick I laid so I could build a new wall to keep me safe. I walked away from every brick I laid to build a new wall to keep me safe. Barred track, right fucking there. Yo, shout out to my child, man. That, that fucking. The whole thing with his dog. Beating the hell and back twice. Does ten million dollars on three different addictions, like what the fuck? And then he's still standing and he's still telling his story. He's still climbing his ladder. <laughs> so there you have it. It can be done.
I think this is up there with my favourites, like with Church. Shit, man, this is... <laughs> Fuck. You know, shout out Nova on that hook, though. I'm finding someone that I know again. I started climbing out the hole I'm in. The people that disappear in there, is that to represent the people who relapse and fall back and maybe don't survive the fight and don't try and climb their ladder again? That's what I'm getting from that. That is a battle cry for recovery. That's, that's the best way I can put it. Battle cry for recovery. <laughs> wow. Yeah, um, please drop me some re uh, requests for my child. Need to hear more of him. <laughs> Fuck. That dude is so deep. To bring him together with Tom and Nova. <sighs> so when he features with other people, I think, this can't get any better. This can't get any better. <sighs> wow. Just greatness. I'm sorry, I'm speechless. That, that, that shit is just like... It's a masterclass, like, you know, it, <sighs> the way you're feeling right there, I've been there many times, like, <sighs> just pure magic, um, shout out to Nova, my child Tom, shout out to Clara, Carolyn, Thank you for requesting this and shout out to the rest of the Hangover Gang. Shout out to the Eternals. Um, if you're new to the channel and you want to join the Eternals family, subscribe, notification bell, like, comment down below what you want me to react to next. And as I always say, it doesn't have to be just music, it can be anything. Um, please, if you've got any requests for my child, drop them in. Um, yeah. Battle Cry for Recovery. Bar the track, I left every brick I laid to build a new wall to keep me safe. I might have got that wrong, but you know what bar that is. Bar the track. So, uh, that was by Mad Child. <laughs> so yeah, um, until the next one guys, peace out homies.